Good afternoon. I'm still reporting on a case of congressional bribery. It looks like New Jersey's senior United States senator is in for some trouble. Senator Bob Menendez was caught with at least four gold bars that are powerful evidence linking him to a bribery scheme. In 2013, a New Jersey businessman named Fred Dabes had his home broken into by armed assailants who took $500,000 in cash and 22 gold bars. The police later caught the suspects and returned the cash and the gold bars to Dabes. Unfortunately for Senator Menendez, the police noted the serial numbers on all of the bars. Fast forward to today. Police investigators raided Menendez's home and found four of the gold bars that used to be in Fred Dabe's home ten years ago. Now they were in Menendez's home without a good explanation of how they got there. The result, Dabe's has been charged in a federal indictment with conspiring to bribe Menendez and conspiring to commit fraud. According to a report in the Daily Wire, The indictment says that Menendez and his wife had a corrupt relationship with New Jersey businessman Whale Hanna, Jose Uribe, and Fred Dabes, who allegedly gave the senator bribes worth hundreds of thousands of dollars. According to the DOJ, the bribes were intended to protect the businessman and to benefit Egypt. And now, suddenly, Senator John Fetterman the new Democrat senator from Pennsylvania, has jumped into the middle of this, calling for Menendez to be expelled from the Senate, which would shift the balance of power in the Senate over to the Republicans and really shift the political landscape for the successful impeachment of Joe Biden. Here's what the astute Fetterman had to say, taking a page from Sherlock Holmes, but reading from a statement card prepared by Vice President Kamala Harris. Senator Menendez, he needs to go. And if you are going to expel Santos, how can you allow somebody like Menendez to remain in the Senate? And you know, Santos is kind of lies and almost, you know, funny. And like, you know, he, you know, landed on the moon and that kind of stuff. Fetterman continued to eloquate with his unique charm. Whereas, you know, I think you know Menendez, I think is really a senator for Egypt. You know, not New Jersey. So I really think he needs to go. He he has the right for his day in court and all that, but he doesn't have the right to those kinds of votes and things that that's not a right. And I think we need to make that kind of decision to send him out. I think the Republicans should immediately draft Fetterman into the Republican Party. It would not only give the Republicans a two-vote edge in the Senate, but make every other Republican in Congress look brilliant. I'm still reporting from just outside the citadel of world freedom. Good day. Good day.